How great is that? It's bullseye. Oh, 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 if we get sugary treat here, we kill Starch Lord. Come on, come on, it's a 50, 50, 50. <laughs> yeah, right. Damn, that's so strong. Now we're gonna draw two more cards, guys. <laughs> oh, isn't that a fail? <laughs> Why am I always getting thinking cap? I don't want that. Complete garbage. Another one. What? Is he setting up a canalith? That's some bruv right there. I don't care who you are. <laughs> Ooh, here's some bruv. He's so setting up a canalith. Let's just do this way. Keep the tempo going, boys. Now what? What the? No, this is just a troll sniper guy. Why would he play the potato mine? I'm so confused. Yeet. Another card. <laughs> Forget about blocking cheese cutter. That wouldn't be. That'd be useless. I have to just make sure to not get OTK'd by Picanola here, and I'll be fine. There's no real way to play around it here, is there? We'll just hit him with the coffee. I hope he doesn't have Doom Shroom. That would be really bad. No Doom Shroom. No Doom Shroom. Oh my gosh, that scared me. What is this guy doing? This is pretty broke. I don't know. Don't ask questions, guys. It's not worth it. Uh-oh, he got Weenie Beanie. We lose. What the f Jesus. For the win! <laughs> Come on! Come on, let's go! <laughs> God damn it. How do we have two evaporates in our hand? This is not okay. No, this is not okay. Starch Lord, of course it's right. Of course it's Starch Lord. No one would have ever thought that it's not Starch Lord. We won! What a miracle! What a come from behind victory. We're kinda messed up right now. <gasps> oh, the combo. The one and only. Combo Nation, let's go. This ensures that we get another card for next turn, which is our number one priority. How great is that? It's Bullseye. It's a, it's a race. Could you not? Oh. It, this trades now. Oh my goodness, that's such a good strength. This was in his starting hand. Let's go. Plus the card, plus the three damage. It's not bullseye anymore, but you know. <gasps> yes, and we got a lake him card. I'll definitely take it. It's time to make it splash. Aha, easy 2-0. Oh. Humongous if. Yes, and those draws. Oh, this guy's screwed. So he had to use Galactus on one drop, so he just doesn't have anything to front this with. That's a decent card. In fact, we can ramp to Bad Moon Rising. I actually kind of don't want to play this yet. I'm gonna just play the Imp Commander here. I want to do the thing where you where you play this into the Nebula and then you use a teleport to transform it. So we'll draw another card now. Yeah, we're gonna actually try to get some kind of ramp Bad Moon Rising going like next turn already. In fact, this is a zero cost interdimensional zombie, so it ramps even more than a regular one. Would when the regular one's good in this game. I know I could have used this to activate next turn. I forgot this is a science card. Hmm, interesting. We actually have easy Bad Moon Rising right now. <laughs> like, easy. The teleport will give us one extra. We don't really need to use the teleport. I could anyway, just to prevent one of these guys from getting hit. Teleport will help us search for booty. He does not cover the environment. He does take out two guys though. All right, this is fine. Bad Moon Rising on turn, I don't know, 5, I don't know what turn this is. So we get Wannabe Hero, which is a 6-16. Merit Moon Rising, we usually, nah, it's guaranteed lead. Good game. <laughs> I'll teleport in the cheese cutter. Oh gosh, oh, that's a great, wow, that's a horrific answer. This is still worth it, even though it takes one one damage here. The Drone Engineer is gonna die. Teleportation Zombie is gonna be a 2-4 a two four now, which is pretty good. What do we get? We like a lunchbox. Trigger Treater in this deck could be really good, actually. Trigger Treater Evaporate Treat. The treat will make the gadget scientists stronger next turn. Gives us a way to protect the teleportation zombie too here. Oh, 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 if we get sugary treat here, we kill Starch Lord. Come on, come on, come on. It's a 50, 50, 50. It's 50, 50. We're actually drawing two cards here. <sighs> Piece of garbage. So we could go with the Moonwalker here with 5-5, five, five, but might as well just play the, the one with Frenzy. I I, I, I kind of want to play around him removing the 2-4. I guess it's just Shrinking Violet. This makes it, this is not so bad against Shrinking Violet. Uh, if we get one more hearty treat. <sighs> <laughs> We're getting everything we don't need. See if he has third shamrock. <laughs> Come on, man. Look at this three cost five five. The stats are real. Again, if it were for Shamrock, this would be so much better. Okay, so how do we make lethal happen here? We buff you. Yeah, and we just need any treat. Any treat wins. Guaranteed lethal, right? La 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 la. Treats are actually really good with science. Like very often I'll do like Professor Brainstorm. Sugary treat science. So that is a pretty good trigger treater there. This is the one you kinda want. 
Wow, so this draws now. Give me something cheap, please. You don't want to get King of the Grill here. That's fine. <laughs> we just got a one-cost bonus attack. But he's actually feeding us another card. <laughs> Free shot. Oh, man. This is 2-2 two -two worth of stats. Damn, that's so strong. Let's surround this here. Try to draw out the spike weed sector. We can even bonus attack evaporate if we want. Or we can go after this one that has more health. <laughs> Screw it. That's what we're doing. <laughs> Guys, this is not fair. Oh, can we make this live? So this really represents a free three drop next turn. Sure, I'll take it. I forgot if we can play the zero cost. Oh, he didn't block. Okay, uh, it would have only been a four. Oh no, I, Rum Rumble would have done it. Bros. Dragon? Dragon for kind of bad. Did I play around dragon? <laughs> it doesn't help at all. Helps not. not. Naughty boy. Do not get- wait, did he get- Get go to fight, please. <laughs> the most useless go- Oh, no cat ladies. No cat ladies. Yes! We're back, folks! We're back! We're back to cheese! Got him, easy. <laughs> it's called unzucchini pie. That was so great. I think this is fine just to scoop. If he fronts, if he doesn't front it, we let this hit face. If he does, then we scoop. Aha! It's trick or treat secret agent. <laughs> I don't know. Get treats. This opens up a lot of stuff. I'm just gonna play that and we'll teleport in the 5-5 five five so it doesn't get shamrocketed. If he goes for the double play, we're gonna have goat. Just stick a goat in front of this and we'll be able to evaporate it. Oh, look at this guy go. Now he just has a primal potato mine sitting. Okay, really? <laughs> the man is a genius. Can we do this play though? Guys, look at the plays. So this will be a 4-4. Four, four. Yeah, let's just do this. Look at this play. This is exactly what we built the deck around with Teleportation Zombie on the field. This is gonna take five turns to kill a Teleportation Zombie, by the way. That was not at all a good play. What was this play, guys? Now I have a Teleportation Zombie on the field for the next five turns. Ooh, Garg Feast. Not bad. We're never gonna get to that. Right. One cost bonus. It's like a, it's like a zombie time to shine. I think you gotta play around Planet of the Grapes here. So you pass. Watch him play it anyway. <laughs> yeah, right. Okay, I'll trade a bonus for a card plus an admiral. Still sort of want to play around Cycle, but maybe I shouldn't. Uh oh. Oh no, okay, I'm saving this for next turn. We're gonna get some, uh, some bruvs. Can I get like a Trapper Territory? Oh my god. Uh oh. Okay, California intensifies. Hmm, it's kind of greedy actually. Oh, I should have played Botanist and filled this instead of Astra. It's so smart. Oh, I oh that was a misplay. You play Botanist here. No, but he doesn't have it anyway. Okay, we're gonna make a redemption play. <laughs> Loser. Got him. <laughs> oh no. Man's running very angry. This guy, he wasted all of his admirals. He's just not playing this correctly. We're still in a little bit of trouble, but I think we're okay here. It would be Nice if we had the bonus attacks. We'll do it this turn. This is such a good thing. Okay. <laughs> Get clogged. We made double redemption. More pea shooters. All right. Now we're buffing this and doing two bonus attacks. Five. Does it work? Uh. Uh. Another one. Uh. Uh. Die. And we win. Seven plus seven. Thank you, vampire. <laughs> we beat Cycle Cat. Um. That's another. Guys, look at the dream. Are you kidding me? So we have mustache waxer, cheese cutter, cheese cutter. Guys, this is turn two. This is turn two. Get wrecked. Every lane's clogged. How is Agro Solar Flare supposed to get through this crap? He's gonna play Apple Saucer to contest one of these. Then what's gonna happen? Are you kidding me? Now we're gonna draw two more cards, guys. <laughs> and we're actually gonna have, um, oh, that's a mustache. That's a mustache. We actually got a gourmet mustache here. It's pretty good. La 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 la. So this will kill his guy, draw an extra card, and also put seven damage on this face. So good. <laughs> it's maniacal bats. We get two more cards for next turn, which is so clutch. The gadget scientist would be good. Oh, he rolls a three. God damn it. He can't kill a seven four at least. At least we drew a card. This is not what we, this is not good. Guys, this is not good. We'll go for the cheese. This rocket can remove something here, so. Safety cornucopius. That's guaranteed lethal now. Wow. GG. <laughs> he had you can't run <laughs> grapes as you're finished. <gasps> oh no! Oh, it was turn 11! <laughs> Too bad! <laughs> oh, 
wasn't that a fail. I could have BM'd by covering this. I know, who cares? Damn. Garg Feast would have been so- that- Garg Feast was literally the best card to get from Cheese Cutter there if we hadn't won. Oh well.